Hello, I'm Daniel Amo Filva, and in this video I'm going to present our paper Learning Analytics Privacy in the FOC and Edge Computing a Systematic Mapping Review. We know that in educational context, um, context when we use learning analytics, um, there is a, a real fragility in the data processing. Some unknown actors are found in between uh, technologies that are used to uh, treat all of these uh, collected data and when we move these analytical technologies to the cloud uh, we increase that uh, fragility and sensitivity in educational environments where learning analytics is used so but we have a trending solution that is used local or closer to the user analytical technologies the idea is to use uh, that software not in the cloud uh, but closer to the to the user um, we know that that the clock computing is split into other layers, uh, the fog computing and the edge computing. The fog computing is that layer where data is processed in the nodes before sending the results to the clock computing. And the edge computing is that layer that uh, comprehends all the devices of the users, is the layer uh, nearer to the user, where data is processed and aggregated and then sent to the fog computing and the clock computing uh, layer. And we ask ourselves if this approximation, the fog computing and the edge computing is useful to prevent uh, those problems associated with uh, the privacy. Um, and our work uh, aims to check if uh, these in-between positions of data computations is to say fog computing or edge computing is valid to prevent those uh, problems uh, regarding uh, data privacy. So what we have done in this uh, work is uh, conduct a systematic mapping review using the Prisma methodology and use the Web of Science and the Scopus indexing um, databases. We found more than 2,000 uh, papers in those uh, databases and only 43 uh, studies were uh, related to the problem to the domain to learning analytics and data privacy to the domain of, uh, of the study between 2017 and 2021 however uh, only seven of these 43 studies are directly related to uh, learning analytics the other are related with uh, technical aspects that can be transferable to learning analytics to prevent those problems of uh, data privacy. We have here two images, um, one from the FOC computing. These are um, the domains that um, the papers are working on. So uh, in FOC computing, machine learning and Internet of Things are two domains heavily related with this FOC computing. And in, in the edge computing, we have uh, heavy domains related to like uh, federated learning, video analytics, machine learning, and, and deep learning. All are related to data analysis using uh, machine learning and technologies and methods associated. So, in conclusion, we can say that for computing and edge computing can solve um, these uh, privacy problems in an emergent way inside education. We found only seven papers regarding data privacy and learning analytics. So there is still a long way to go um, in research to set effective and generalized solutions uh, in these two domains uh, fields. However, there is a clear tendency to use data processing and analytic technologies closer to the, to the users, to say, use the edge computing instead of the clock computing. And we can conclude in this work that more relevant works will begin to appear in this field in a short time. And we hope that uh, finally we can solve or reduce considerably uh, all these data privacy problems related to uh, learning. Analysis.